This tutorial will show you how to use Google Draw to create a meme assignment in Google Classroom. So for those of you who don't know what a meme is, here's an example, just putting on my glasses. So all a meme is, is is a picture with some text on it. Usually it's pretty funny and it's relevant to the actual picture. This can be a very, very powerful um, learning activity for students. So how do you create one of these? Well, I'll show you. So we'll go to Google Drive to begin. Now we'll click on New. We need to get to Google Draw, which is found under More. There we go, Google Drawing. So now step one is going to be to add a picture to this. So the quickest way to add a picture um, in Google Draw or any Google um, program such as Sheets, uh, Docs, anything like that is to go to Tools right here. Click on Tools, then click on Explore. So now we will do a Great Depression meme. I'm a social studies teacher, so that's how I get my idea there. Um, so let's choose this one here. The guys are standing out in front of a uh, soup kitchen, it looks like. All right, so I'm going to make it smaller right away just so I can move the file. Okay, so we're going to put it right there. Bring it to the edge. Now we can slide this over so it really hugs that picture really well. There we go. So we're going to call this just meme example how about there we go so uh, what you need to do now and this is my advice is to give students an actual example so click on insert then you're gonna go text like I just did and you're gonna type some text in here when you should have saved your money under your couch cushion a little bit of humor is always good in a meme. So we need to make this text white so we can see it better. I'm going to bold it. I'm going to make it larger like that. There we go. Put it at the bottom, an area where you can easily see it. And then I'll go a step further here, and I'm going to center it a little better. There we go. So now we've created a meme. But now we want to show students how they can create a meme, or we need to give them a blank um, picture without the text on there to do that. So what we're going to do here is go back to Google Drive, and we'll see that meme examples on there. Let's right-click that and go make a copy. Okay, so now we're, uh, we've got a copy of it here, and we're going to rename it. In this one, we're just going to name Meme. Now we need to open up this one, and we're going to take away the text. Clicking on it, we need to get it so the arrows show up. There we go. Hit delete. Now that is gone. So the students can use this one to type their own text on there. And now you see they're both going to be here in uh, Google Drive. So the next step now is to go to Google Classroom and we'll go create an assignment. Call it Meme. And we'll say something like create a meme for this picture. Use the example to get an idea of how to do this. There we go. We won't worry about the due date, the topic. Now what we need to do though is go to uh, Google Cla or Google Drive right here to attach both of those that were just created. So we'll start with the meme. We'll add it. Okay, so this is the one that students are going to edit. So what we need to do is click on make a copy for each student. Okay, then next we'll go back to Google Drive. We will now click on the meme example to include that one too. And then lastly, we'll click on assign. So now we see it right here. We can see the instructions, both of the memes, the, the regular meme and the example. Let's look on the student view here and see what they see on this one. Go back, there we go. So students can open this up then. And what they can do is look at the example right away to get an idea of what they should be doing, okay? Then the students can go click on their own. In this one, they're able to edit, and they can add their own text.